Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I have a very special gift for you. Not only will I be sharing knowledge, but I'll also be sharing a very powerful exercise to help you reach your goals. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Check it out. Alright, so let's get started now. Before we do so, I want to give a quick shout out to Anthony Robbins, aka Tony Robbins. He's the author of Awaken the Giant Within, this book right over here. Now, all the exercises, principles, and concepts will be derived directly from this book. So, definitely make sure you check it out and get yourself a copy as well. It's a really powerful book. Alright, and all you'll be needing for this exercise are three things. Number one, my video. Number two, a pen or pencil to write with. And number three, a notepad or some form of paper that you can write with. As you can see, I did the exercise myself. And the reason I'm sharing this with you guys is because this exercise was very powerful. It helped me see how far I've come in the past couple of years and it really gave me a direction as to where I want to go in the future so um, I definitely want to share this with you guys I hope you know it helps you along your journey in some way shape or form I know it definitely helped me so I know it'll help you as well perfect so let's go ahead and get started we're going to flip to page find it here page 290 and it's actually a pretty simple exercise. And first thing that we're gonna do is write down these 10 categories. Number one, physically. Number two, mentally. Number three, emotionally. Number four, attractiveness. Number five, relationships. Number six, living environment. Number seven, socially. Number eight, spiritually. Number nine, career. And number 10, financially. What you're gonna do is you're gonna rate yourself from five years ago. You're gonna give yourself a score from one through 10. And in addition to that, you're gonna write one or two sentences to whatever comes to mind of where you were at, um, for example, physically five years ago, write something down about it. Mentally, where were you, emotionally, etc. And take your time on doing that. You know, it takes a little bit of time. I mean, take as much time as you need. This is really important. And you won't be sharing this with anyone. So uh, write down whatever comes to mind and don't, don't hesitate to write something super important. And once we finish that part, next we're going to do, um, we're gonna rate ourselves on today's scale. So again, one through 10, 10 being the highest. You're gonna write down for those same 10 categories, you're gonna write, you're gonna give yourself a score and you're also gonna give yourself a sentence, one or two things, first thing that comes to mind of where you feel you are today and this is really actually a very important exercise it's going to give you a more detailed perspective of how much progress you've made what distinctions you've made maybe you made more progress in some areas than you thought you would and this is really going to give you an idea of what you want to work on in the future so very important exercise make sure you guys do both make sure you write everything down and be true to yourself. So write whatever is, is true. Don't be afraid to hide anything. This is gonna be for you and you only. Once you finish that, you're going to write a, about a paragraph of what you learned, some key moments, some, some areas that you thought you made most progress in, things you need to work on. This is also very important because it's gonna set you up for the next exercise. And this is super important. This is the section that you will be goal setting. Um, so now that you know what you need to work on and what, um, what areas are important to you, you're going to write it down right here. And you're gonna give yourself five years from now, where do I wanna be physically, mentally, emotionally? 
financially, career-wise, spiritually, socially, living environment. And instead of writing, uh, writing I want, write I will. And this is super important. Make sure you are very detailed and aim high. Now, once you finish writing down your five-year goals, the next step is to, on a separate piece of paper, write down exactly where you want to be one year from now. What do you want to accomplish? What fears do you want to conquer? What's something that motivates you? Where do you want to be career-wise, financially, physically, etc.? Write that down. And the key is to, at least twice a day, you must rehearse and emotionally enjoy the experience of achieving one of your goals. Again, at least twice a day, make sure you review and emotionally experience achieving your goals. And as for myself, I'll do whatever it takes to achieve my goals and truest desires, ethically, obviously. By publicly declaring this, it will be much more difficult to stray from my path when challenging or frustrating times set in. When I'm tired or uncertain or when I feel like things aren't going my way, memories of this video will keep me going. If we continue to head in the right direction, we may not only achieve the goals we're pursuing, but a lot more with it. Remember this, all your problems, discouragements, heartaches, are truly opportunities in disguise. Focus, be patient, stay committed to your goals, and rehearse them twice a day. Thanks for watching.